Hey guys, welcome back. Today I am going to share with you guys what I got for my March 2017 Ipsy bag. Now, before we go into the video and the unbagging of my bag today, I first wanted to share with you guys that I will be going to Generation Beauty in San Francisco! And guess who's going to come with me? And she's super excited because this is going to be her first 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 time going just guess just take a wild guess Melanie's gonna go yay come here are you excited to go yeah yay what are you gonna get over there at Generation Beauty we're gonna get a lot of makeup yeah I'm so excited yeah 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 <laughs> <laughs> so yes we will be going to generation beauty in san francisco i am super excited because it does fall on my birthday weekend hey so what i'm gonna do is that i'm gonna link uh, where you can buy the tickets down below. Hopefully I get to see some of my new besties. Yay! Also, don't forget to follow me in all of my social media. It is always linked down below. Follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. I don't know why all of a sudden I get an accent whenever I would say everything. All those social media websites. Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter. I can't help it. <laughs> Also, I do realize that I kind of match with my background. It was not done intentionally. Jump right in. So I already know what the bag looks like because of course it's been all over Instagram. And it's actually really cute and it matches with me. Can you guys tell what my favorite color is? Hint, hint, wink, wink, no? Well, this is my favorite color and what I love about this bag is that it's a little bit longer. Um, I didn't realize how small the other bag was. It was probably about half the size. It was. This is how the other bag was and I really can't fit a lot of things, at least not the stuff that I want to fit in there. But this one, I definitely like that it's longer. Look at that. Where did I go? Ooh, I'm blending in. Camouflage. <gasps> Okay, so this is the bag, and here is the card. I really like what it said, what this month's card says. It says, you are beautiful, pass it on. Pretty is as pretty does. Share this card with someone who could use a little love. So I really like it, it's really cute. And I might just give this to my mama. I hope she's not watching. And then she could pass it on to my ugly sisters. Okay, so the first product in the bag is this Freematic eyeshadow. Freematic eyeshadow. Let's see. I've never heard of this brand before. Never ever. Oh, it's tiny. I thought it was gonna be bigger. Obviously, sample size. There's no way this would be a full size product. Well, I like the way it comes in. It's a little velvet carrier, and then there's the <laughs> tiny itty bitty eyeshadow. Okay, so it comes right off. Now let's see if it's pigmented. Oh, that's actually very pigmented. See that right there? I went ahead and I did it three times to see how much I could use and wow seems to be very pigmented it does have like a shimmer to it so I would probably be using it on my lid it actually looks a lot like what I'm wearing right now that's kind of interesting I like it these are the colors I tend to gravitate towards okay so the next <laughs> I felt this and I could have sworn it felt like it was a tampon <laughs> I was just holding on to it like that, like that. Okay, so this is the next one. It is an Elizabeth Mott blending brush. You can never have too many blending brushes. Mm. 
I also like using these small blending brushes to highlight sometimes. Sometimes I want more of a precise highlight and that's I like using my blending brushes for that. Wow, this actually blends it out really, really nice. I was I had some harsh lines on top. Shame on me. I was in a hurry and didn't blend everything, but oh my goodness, that uh, that honestly it blended out the the edges really nicely and I've you I've only done a couple of strokes back and forth in a little bit. So yeah, definitely I would I I am going to put good good use to it. All right, now the next thing, I saw some people get these way is it way way hair care hair care by jen atkins i believe she is the kardashian hairstylist um i've never tried any of her products but supposedly they're supposed to be really really good this is what the packaging looks like it, it's always very plain it's just white and this and is a treatment mask Mesque. Mesque, okay and it is supposed to be a restorative healing mask that's formulated to repair damage in minutes. I don't know if you guys can see it on camera, but my ends are completely damaged. And I am not gonna cut it, okay? Don't, I am not ready to say let go. Don't even try to convince me otherwise. Cause I'm just not, I, no, no. It, I I will decide whether or not this works for me or not. Usually when something says, oh, instant minutes, it just instant repair, instant this, instant that. No, it doesn't. I need more than an instant repair. Maybe if I, maybe once I'm done with the bottle, maybe. Maybe it'll be restored or something. We'll see. So it says that you smooth it evenly through hair. Combining with fingers, if needed, chill out for five to ten minutes, then rinse. And voila, you're supposed to have instantly revitalized hair. I don't know. We'll see. Let's see. It's white. Blend it. It's just, I mean, it's just a cream for your hair. It, it feels like any other hair product that you have put on your hair. It smells good. I don't know how to explain it. it smells like hair salon. <laughs> okay, the next product in my baggie is ooh Bahama Mama bronzer. Itty bitty bronzer. What am I supposed to do with this? Oh, actually, I know what I can do with this. So I saw Gabriel Zamora, Gabby, I saw him, he said an amazing tip and he said that you can use little sample bronzers because of course you are not going to be able to bronze your whole face with this little itty bitty. So what he suggested was using a small brush and I'm just going to use this one just to demonstrate. Use it to contour your nose. Yes. Did I contour my nose today? I don't remember. Let me try. Oh god. Oh god. Woo! Okay, so I was not expecting the bronzer to be that pigmented. Oh my god, that took me a while to blend out, but it's finally blended and look at me. I look like Laza Manelli. I've actually never used the Bahama Mama or any of the Balm products, or have I? I don't believe I have. So I'm kind of excited for this. I might purchase the full size once I run out of this, or I'll try to bronze my whole face with this little thing. Don't test me. I'll try it. Okay, so last but not least, is the pore refining hydrating anti-aging brightening smoothing facial detox purifying recovery mask <sighs> that was a mouthful 
This is a facial detox mask, which what it's supposed to do is supposed to pull all of your impurities. It's supposed to refine your pores, hydrate. It's supposed to be anti-aging, brightening, and smoothing. So it says, wash your face and hands, apply a thin layer to your face, leave mask on for 7 to 11 minutes, and experience a slight tingling sensation. It doesn't say tingling, it says tingling. Okay, so overall, the, the products that I am extremely excited to try are the treatment mask, the brush of course because like I said you can never have too many brushes and the eyeshadow I really want to just try that I don't know where I'm going to store this I have a feeling that they're going to get lost or Melanie is going to take it because she likes little things and she just thinks they're cute and she puts them in her little purse because she's a little girly girl I don't know where she gets it from anyway let me know what are some of the products that you got in your bag i've been seeing so many cool stuff out there i saw this snail was it a snail cream or something like what's up with that what's up with the snail cream what's up with that slime i don't know i don't get it <laughs> also don't forget to let me know if you guys are going to generation beauty and if you are and you happen to see me there like I said, Melanie is going, so you'll see me, and then you'll see a little mini me, and then you'll see a guy recording behind us. If you see us, make sure to say hi. I try to put out videos every week. Don't forget Melanie Mondays. Don't forget Melanie Mondays. Melanie's always excited to um, film those videos well, most of the time. If for any reason we don't film a Melanie Monday, it's because she's just not feeling it. And you can't make me little Miss Diva record okay she just won't be having it she'll be like me 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 the whole time thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next video mm.